Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to another episode of Paper Mario Color Splash for the Nintendo Wii U. In the last part, we explored the Sacred Forest, um, where, uh, well, we were able to explore more of the Sacred Forest, where everything was small, really small, teeny tiny. Um, and um, now we are taken to uh, this very long pathway over here to Cobalt Base. So um, I think that's the only thing that we can do right now. So without further ado, let's go ahead and go into Cobalt Base. Okay, so let's see what we got going on here. Is that a giant white spot with Bowser on it? I'm buying? What am I supposed to be buying? A thousand coins? I mean, sure. Wait, what? 30 cards? I have to make room for 30 cards? How can I do that? Alright. Whatever. I guess I have to do it. Alright. I guess I'm just probably going to donate my cards at the uh, Prisma Museum, I, I suppose. Let me do that real quick. Okay, I am back, and I got my 30 cards, so, or I've gotten rid of 30 cards, so, um, here we go. So I got a bunch of stuff. Alright, so, um, obviously I can't show this off, but, um, uh, if you look, you can actually, like, see that you got a bunch of, like, really, like, a wide variety of different cards. Um, and, um... Well, I mean, 30 cards, right? All for a thousand coins. You know, sounds like a pretty good deal, I, I, I guess. Wait, is, is this serious? I actually have to paint this, like, entire thing? I like how, like, all the big white spots that we see, like, in some of the levels, like, Huey does not call me out for the, uh, uh, on trying to paint this one, but he calls me out on painting the other ones that we've seen already. Like, logic please. Oh look, I actually finished painting the entire thing. We got some really big cards I can't get because I had to get rid of 30 cards. I made some uh, donations into the Prisma Museum, so that's good on my part. And look, I'm getting all my coins back. So it's like, those a thousand coins I spent, like, I'm easily getting those back. Especially now that, especially since we have Rochambeau Temples. Alright, let's go inside. Wait, that's it? That's easy! What? I fell into a trap! The floor is covered in water, and it looks like this pipe goes down even deeper. Alright, well... Can't go in the water? Oh man, is this a water level? Let's go inside. This is where the pipe is taking me? Where are we? I'm in a bubble! Yeah, cause we're in a bubble and we can breathe in with while we're in a bubble. I guess that that's how it works. What's it like to be in a bubble? Let's get ready to play! What? what? Sniff it or... Whip it? I... This is where it takes me? I'm your host, Sniffit, and our contestant today is, well, if it isn't our old friend Mario. 
Why are we, like, happy about this? This isn't something that we're happy about. If I was, um... If I, if I randomly came into here and I was, like, randomly selected as a contestant, I'd, like... I would be confused. But apparently Mario's not confused at all. Okay, so he's telling us how to play this. Uh, so basically... Uh, what's gonna happen is a card is gonna show up on screen and you have to use the cards in your inventory to figure out which card that is. So, here we go. The contested area? Isn't that just the whole stage? Alright, round one. Spinning card. Identify the card that you see. All right, let's see what we got. This is like a memory game right here. Is that... Is that a hammer card? Is that a big hammer card? It looks like a big hammer card right there. Okay. Unfortunately, I can't show this off because this is on the, uh, the gamepad. Okay, so yep, and by the way, you have to paint it, otherwise um, the game will not count it as um, being right, so um, here we go. Alright. Alright, well, that's the first question, right? Okay, so that was the first round. So we have to win four rounds, four or more rounds, alright? Is that what he just said? Kelp cards? We're gonna show you three cards. Oh god, this is gonna be hard. This is where things start to get hard already. Alright, here we go. Uh, spike jump, worn out jump, and hop slipper. Spike jump, worn out, hop slipper. Okay. Uh, here's a hop slipper. Here's a worn out jump. And where's the spike? Okay, here's the spiky one. Okay. Now let's confirm these. Wait, do they have to be in order? Oh, oh, okay, never mind. That would actually, that would actually really suck if, if they had to be in order. Okay. All right, so that's the second round. Okay, round three. Entwine cards. All right, we got two cards. This is not that bad. Oh God. Uh, triple worn out and pearl hammer. Is that a hurl hammer? I can't tell if that's a hurl hammer. I'm gonna assume that it is. And then, wait. Was it triple worn out or triple regulars? Oh god, I forgot already. Uh. Oh man, I'm, I'm, I'm a little worried. I'm gonna say triple worn out. Alright, hopefully, hopefully this is right. I'm, I'm a little concerned if, if this is actually wrong. Okay, we got the hurl. Okay, it was the uh, worn out. Alright. Cool. Alright, awesome. Okay, round, round four. Paint that card. Oh gosh. We're gonna paint a card right in front of you. You'll need to choose the same card from your hand and then paint it the same amount we painted ours. Oh god. Oh man, this is where we have, we have to be like really perfect, I think. I don't know. Okay, so I painted a little bit of the little like handle and then like halfway like above. Okay. Alright, so we gotta use the plunger. So there's a plunger right here. And then, um, unfortunately, you guys can't see this, which kind of sucks. 
Okay. Oh god, I'm painting really carefully here. I'm going, like, super baby. I don't know- I don't know if the sound effects are- the sound effects on my gamepad are showing on recording. Uh, but, um, I'm, like, literally tapping on my screen just to be, like, as precise as I can. Uh, I feel like that's barely too much, but I don't know how strict this is. So, I think I'm gonna go with it. Oh! Okay, it does not have to be perfect. Alright. Well, thanks! Oh, we're going for a legendary prize? Alright, I guess we're gonna keep playing. Card roulette! We're gonna show you three cards and identify all three of them. Okay, here we go. Uh... Big Eek, Ice, and Spike Helmet. At least I think that's a Big Eek. If it, if there's no way that's regular Eek, I'm pretty sure. Let me see. Okay, so here's a Big Eek. Uh, Spike Helmet. And... Uh, did I forget what the third one is? It was Big Eek Ice- Oh, it was Ice Flower. Okay, I'm gonna put- Alright, okay, I'm gonna put it in an ice- No! 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 Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay, I almost- I almost put in one of my cards as- I almost, like, throw in one of my uncolored cards, and that would've been bad. Uh, so, um... Alright, cool. Alright, here we go. Okay, here's the Ice Flower. There's the Spike Helmet. And there's the Big Eek Hammer! Alright! We're five for five, let's go. All right, round six. Falling cards. All right, okay, we're gonna, okay, there's gonna be three cards falling, so here we go. Uh, big jump, big shroom. Iron jump? Big Shroom, Big Jump, Iron Jump. At least I think that's what that first card was showing. So, Big Shroom, Big Jump. Which one's the Iron? Okay, here's the Iron. Wait. That's not I. Wait, that other card, that's not Iron, is it? I think it is. There's no other card that looks like that, I'm pretty sure. Like, there's no other, like boot card that's like gray at least not the ones that we've encountered so far so i'm gonna assume it's iron jump this is the things that like that that are really tricky to me like i'm i'm really bad at these memory games right here okay it was iron jump all right cool and then the rest of these i got right i know that for sure all right well we're doing pretty good all right we got six rounds and now for the seventh one. Alright, get this one right, and you'll earn the right to try the bonus round. There's a bonus round? Alright. Alright, here we go. Round seven. Card recall. What? Four cards, and I have to remember all of them? Okay, hold on. Let me get a pencil real quick. Alright, I am back with a pencil, because I am a filthy casual. So let's see what we got here. Uh, Hop Slipper, Fire Hammer, uh, Worn Out Hammer, and KO. Which card disappeared? Oh, okay, this is not bad. Alright, so which card disappeared? That's the Fire Hammer, the Blaze Hammer. So we're going to uh, put in the Blaze Hammer in here. I think it's a regular Blaze Hammer. Yeah, there's no big Blaze Hammer, so it's a regular one. So we're going to put it in. Alright, here we go. And it was right! Alright, and that's all seven rounds. Well, Mr. Perfect, you've earned the right to challenge the bonus round. Get all three... 
Wait, why'd you say bonus round? If you if there's three questions to this, then it's bonus rounds. I'll receive an extravagant legendary prize that I can't get anywhere else. Okay. But get even one wrong and it's an instant game over and your file will be erased forever. Oh my goodness. Now that's a lot, especially since we are 20 episodes in, at least 20 video recordings in. And I think by the time, like, this episode gets up, it's like episode 40-something. So, that's a lot of work that I gotta, that I gotta work up to, if I get any of these wrong. Alright, sure. Let's do it. I'm, bu I'm bold, so here we go. Alright, here we go. Falling cards, too. We're gonna show you three cards try to identify all three, okay? Fire Flower, Spike, and Pal. Okay, here we go. So, um, is this one a Fire Flower right here? Let me, let me check this real quick. That is not a Fire Flower, okay. Good thing I good thing I checked that. The thing the, the problem that I have with this is that the fire the uncolored fire flower and ice flower are both the same, so you can't really tell. Um, like if you're choosing the uncolored flowers. Okay, that one's the uncolored fire flower right there. Okay, and we're gonna color in the spike card. The power box already colored in, and we're gonna go ahead and. Uh, Throw our cards in. So here we go. Okay, there's the power block. There's my fire flower. And there's my spike card. You know, it's a good thing that the game does not check like the or the specific order for uh, these rounds. Um, otherwise, this would be way harder. Oh, more paint? Yes, please. Might as well. I mean, 100 coins is nothing in this game. Alright, round two. Kelp cards two. Okay, we're gonna show you three cards to try to identify all three. Oh man. Double jump, big iron, and an e camera. What was the third one? Oh crap. What was the third one? Oh no. Okay, one was double jump. The other one was eek. Oh, it was big iron. It was big iron. Okay. Oh man, anytime I forget one of these, it's it's so scary. Cuz uh Oh man. We're not trying to cause a disaster here. Okay, there's my big iron. There's my double jump. And the e camera! Alright. Oh man, the final question. Card recall? Oh man. We'll show you three cards to remember everything about the scene. Oh my god, is this game serious? Oh man. Uh, sniff it, cheap, cheap blooper. Uh, oh no. Oh no. I was only looking at the enemies! Uh, I was only looking at the enemies. Um, hmm. 
Okay, I am back, and I totally was not peeking at anything or anything like that, so uh, let's go ahead and uh, put in uh, a card that I totally don't remember because I was totally- because I'm totally guessing this right now. So let's go ahead and do it! Uh-oh! Oh no! Uh, dang! <laughs> oh, I gotta do it all over again! Because I tried to... Oh... Which one's a sniff it holding? Oh man. Okay, I wrote this down. It's uh I got it. I got this this time. No cheating or anything like that. I got this. Boom! We did it. Second try strats are easy every time. Alright, we cleared the bonus round. And we are the champion of Snip It or Whip It! And it's now time to claim our legendary prize. Alright, so, yeah, unfortunately, that is what happens if you lose. Um, you just die, which is stupid. Um, because I hate that. Squeeze as hard as you like, okay, time to do it. Man, squeezing the heck out of the instant camera right there. The future of personal photography. Selfie is so real, it will begin to question reality itself. Follow my Snapchat. <laughs> Alright, and we're out. Oh my god. I'm never dealing with that nonsense ever again. Ah, I'm out. Well, at least we 100 percent that area, so, you know, there wasn't really much to do there. And, uh, by the way, that is such an unnecessary part to make that minigame required in order to get to this area. That's completely unnecessary in my opinion, uh, and that's why I say that that, that minigame sucks. Uh, otherwise, like, if it was, like, optional, then I would have, like, liked it more. But because, like, your punishment is to die, that's dumb! That's so poor programming right there. Anyway, time to move on. <laughs>